hi guys welcome back to the channel so if you're new here karibu karibu sana and we're on the road to 500 subscribers so if you've subscribed thank you so much for being here and thank you so much for subscribing and if you're new here kindly consider subscribing and uh, give this video a thumbs up and karibu ni sana so my name is Jean. I'm a mom of two and on today's video it's been a while since I did my cleaning videos since my ring light broke it's been a while but it got fixed and finally I can get back to doing the cleaning videos and also remove some items that we don't use but we actually need them so yeah so let me just show you how the kitchen looks like so yeah and then so I'll just have to throw this away and then this is a situation I was trying to fix the sink hey, it's sink even pair stress and then I need to work down these shelves. So this is where I normally arrange our items. But I think it's high time we just start using a few things here and do away with so much. I just got some of these. Oops. Here there used to be there's a space. There's a there's there's a gap, like you can tell. So I've just had someone fix this just to cover up this space so that i can place our dish rack over here and then uh, make a layer here so that it can try and level with the sink and i'm hoping it will be stable enough yeah Days you start recording, yani you just switch on that camera. Love Gary, yes, yes, I know Peter. Let me tell you, that's what happened to me. That I really didn't mean to mute this area, but yo, yani says in your two message on camera, if you two would attack one to shoot Gary, yes, yes, I know Peter. Na kelele na ngoma, watch it too. So, this is the only storage area I have in this house actually the only storage area we have because under the sink i can't even put food stuff food stuffs under there so yeah i prefer just arranging everything up here and in whichever way that i can so i have two basins one that i put utensils like i've shown you guys and the other one that i put food i put food items and then on the second shelf i just arrange our foods and yeah I actually wish I could add like two more shelves because there's a space between the end of this shelf and uh, the up above the above the microwave but I can't you guys I can't I'm telling you even um when we were drilling uh, to put up the whatever we use for okay please ni make a TV it's like when this house was being built Mchanga ilizidi simiti, if that makes sense. So any drilling you try to do, it will just mess you up. Even for the cutting rods, like sometimes, there's sometimes back one of them was trying to fall and I just had to get a fundi to fix it for me because the walls are not stable. And trust me, I wouldn't want to risk that with anything. So yeah, I just work with what I have here. And it's just for the timing. I'm just manifesting before the end of the year at least we'll move to a bigger house. But for the time being, I work with what I have. So yeah.
The lighting was changing kidogo. It was in that stable, but um, I'm sure you guys can see what I was doing here. I was trying to arrange our spaces in this small um, rack, and everything turned out pretty well, I must say. And I was really happy. So I don't know if I'm the only one who does this. The yellow oil container, since I don't have an oil dispenser, so what I normally do, I get I have the five liter bottle of or container for oil. So I use this container Nagawiya, Nagawa Kidogo Hapa, and then yeah, that's it. It's manageable to use the small container. So that's how I use it. But hopefully things will change soon. And also the the towel that I used here, and for me your towel is badly karangi kabisa. And at the end of the video, I think I'll just soak it. I'll soak it with some jig and hot water. Because hot water does magic to stains and trying to brighten your clothes. Or anything that's just... Just to stab on stains. Huh? So, yeah. To my shadow, to the sun rays. And There was no water on the sink, so I have to just put two basins of water or just something on the sink to to keep on cleaning. However, this I had an issue with the sink, the tap that is, but that was fixed. Just to know to make you smile. Let me see something about this paste. It's something that I buy, but I don't really like it. <laughs> By the way, I normally buy this paste, but I don't really like it. But I actually do it once in a while because I'm used to making my own soap, the liquid detergent. I just make it and I prefer using it when cleaning the dishes. I don't know how I feel about this paste, but either way, I still get it at times. And I really miss making the detergent um, and uh, also our hand wash in Asia. So those are things I'll be making pro probably in, I'm not so sure if it, I'll do that in the next video, but we'll see because I do not have hand wash. I do not have even jig. I normally make it, but just for the house, not for selling and also the liquid detergent. And I prefer using the liquid detergent to clean the dishes it's really nice 
and also sometimes to clean the blankets if you do like if you if you clean blankets for yourself i at some point prefer even if it's just soaking using the liquid detergent it's really really nice So I have these three jars that I no longer use. I actually, I won't say I don't use them, but there's a time we used to use them. But uh, this is the only place I can put my items. And then, so guys, this is a bathroom set. I was gifted in, uh, God, will I remember? I think this was 2014. Christmas Santa and imagine I've never used this set. I've never used it. But I'm still keeping it there. Hopefully one day or once we move out I'll be able to put a shelf probably around the sink area where I'll just arrange them. This is for the soap. I think this is the cup for you can use when brushing your teeth or something, this is a soap dispenser and now you can put your toothbrushes here. So I wanna arrange here probably things that I won't be able to use and remove things that you can use, like these plates, I think it's time to zitumine too. And then they've just been here for a while. Also these glass jars, they were four. Yeah, they were four. And they were also a gift from Secret Santa. And one broke. The blue one broke. So, yeah. So, let's continue. I'm glad at least everything is clean. I think I'll just use this rug. Because probably I'll get one soon. Next week, probably in Kamukunji. Because, ah, ah, That place, that corner, and I think it's... We just need another dish rack because I can't get the fourth Kaleg or the fourth, fourth Kastan for this. Yeah, so let's continue with this video. And I'm almost done.
And this thing I'm using to scrap the sink with, I got it for 50 bob. And it's, it really comes in handy when even doing your daily dishes for the, like just cleaning the sufferias alone. It really comes in handy. And it shines everything. Yani, it just keeps the sufferias looking a bit clean or a bit shiny. Inside midnight, you can say all that you want, but you and I were meant for this. You know, sometimes we hide behind this illusion that we're done. This banner has really served us, and I normally make sure that I clean it thoroughly and make sure like it doesn't rust because most of the times. Because of water and all, it rusts. It shows some rusts, kidogo, but I always try to scrub it vizuri. Also, you can see the stains on the walls. Here's the seal chafu. It's the paint in a pill. Paint in a pill. And I'm telling you guys, hakaka towel. You couldn't say this towel is a light blue towel. Like you guys see. Yo chafu yote. Yo towel, imejoni atu maneno. Sometimes you gotta let go 
Look at how clean that sink is. Ah. So I've decided to put our water here. This rack over here and it has a few onions but I'll figure out where I'll put it if this will not work ama nito a he but ya ju and there are spurious this whole place is clean and well organized so I'm glad that this this basin doesn't have much utensils that means I need to get utensils on a serious note. So he, this is anywhere a jug, I'll just return it. So here are spices. Yeah. And at least I have three plastic plates, this tumblers, this jug and this basin, and this plate. So yeah, I just want to try and limit the number of plastics we have in this house. And I, I think I just like, like this setup. So we have our spoons, muikos over here. And yeah, the sink is so clean. You can tell it's getting dark outside. So I've also cleaned down there because there was a lot of mm, dust. And then we have this kamat. This used to be our carpet. And then I just nikakatanisha into a few pieces so moja iko hapa and overall everything is clean but i am tired but i really like this i'm just loving this whole thing So this is where I store our water and I also cleaned this this place. Um this small katang we gonna put it on your chalk and then this other one used to store water and it's clean as well. Just when I'm done cleaning, you imagine a rudy life. Thank you so much guys for watching this video until this far. If you have, I love you, love you so much. So yeah, um, kindly consider subscribing. Give this video a thumbs up and uh, let's get to 500 subscribers and even to a thousand. So thank you so much guys. Nawapenda sana and uh, see you on the next one. Bye.